Jesus. He's he's done it again. Soldier Boy is yet again at it with another shit console that he wants to sell to his fans for $100 when you can pick this up on AliExpress for 25 bucks. I've had this console for about six months because my channel is all about fake, crappy, retro handhelds, and it's here. I've got it. This is this is what he's trying to sell everyone, and I picked this up for, I think, less than $25. I think I picked this up for 20 bucks, and I can confirm it's pretty bad, and it is most definitely a ripoff to the PS Vita, and I'm looking on his site now. It was originally 200 bucks, but it's on sale for 99 Bargain. I'm gonna take two. What colors does it come in? Oh look, it's already sold out. Great. It comes in blue, black, and red. I've got the black because it most resembles the PS Vita. Let's take a look at some features. Exquisite crafts, but I haven't read this. I actually haven't read this. I just got back from work and I'm coming in and just turn on the camera. Exquisite craftsmanship and fashion design with a reasonable price. You could not fit any more bullshit in one line. Built-in camera for photo shooting and video recording. Okay, 4.3 inch screen of a HD screen of res 16 by 9 HD screen, resolution 480 by 272. Bruv, I just hit the, I just hit the mic because I'm so angry. That is not HD. That is far from it. And then there's a bunch of other stuff. Well, I'm going to push this to the side and I'm going to let you guys see. This is the console here. This is the Soldier Boy handheld. And it's basically just a Chinese ripoff of a PS Vita and he's gonna get away with actually selling this stuff. So there's the console and you get some premium exquisite craftsmanship earphones which could probably, you could probably slice bread with that. It's that sharp. You also got a micro USB for charging as well. So here it is. This is, this, it's upside down, the Soldier Boy handheld. This thing, it feels like, you know, the inside of a Kinder Egg. It's that bad. It's super clicky. The buttons are terrible, but I'll give it, it looks like a PS Vita ever so slightly. If you were to look at this from a distance, it does look like a PS Vita, without a doubt. On the back as well, you get some really weird kind of like PlayStation symbols. Uh, portable media player, eight gigabytes in here, and there you get the the really good HD camera on the front, on the back there. You get some volume buttons, USB. Um, good God, this thing is shite. Um, now, like I can already tell, this is gonna be an absolute state. But like, you've got the D-pad, which like it's def. It, I feel like I could snap this. I could definitely snap this. And he's trying to sell this shit for a hundred bucks. All right, let's let like I know what to expect. I'm gonna turn it on and show you what you get. I don't know how. Does he say there's games pre-built into this? Uh, I don't know if you can hear that. The speaker's broken on this one, and it came like that. I'm not even joking. Now, on your screen, you can see like the array of games that it comes built with. This one comes with like Crash Bandicoot, Super Mario, Astro Boy, Dragon Ball. It's got like a video player, a terrible, terrible camera that looks like it's been shot for a potato. It's got Street Fighter, and I'll admit it probably won't come with these games. Like, does it say it comes with some games? They're definitely going to be taking away the Super Mario one. You can guarantee that because he most certainly got a huge fine the other day. Um, it doesn't say if it comes with games. It just says it plays games. Supports PC camera, connect computer. Like, my God. But if he's selling this straight from China, this is what it's going to come built with. And I don't think he even knows, like, this is what's gonna happen, you know? Like, it comes with Super Mario, and, like, it does play it, but the controls are pretty clicky. Like, this is without even 25 bucks. Me spending 25 bucks on this, that's a push. I was like, shit, you know? I was hoping I'd pay, like, 15 bucks for it. But 200 bucks that he's selling for retail, slashed price at $99. My God, 200 bucks almost get a switch with that a real nintendo product so i don't even know if like sony is gonna send him a letter and be like dude 
You gotta give us some money. You're in deep trouble. And now we're playing Super Mario on this thing. Like, it's just, it's stretched. You've got, oh, it's just disgusting. There's frame rate drops. It is just an awful, how the fuck do I turn this down? I gotta click it like a thousand times to turn it down. Like, whatever he's doing here is just a big mistake. Like, this thing, like, I'll, I'll, let, I'll let him off. Like, it looks pretty cool. And it does resemble a PS Vita, but he can't sell this. And it comes with a TF card slot. Does his come with a... Let me have a look. He's hiding, this, he's hiding the ports on his... Uh, the bloody picture in his... On his site is upside down, like, on the screen. The card's upside down. So I have no idea... And even when I turn it down, that hissing is still there. So, if you want to buy a really bad MP5 player, I think that's what he's trying to sell as. It's not a game system. You know, he got shot for that once from Nintendo. Like, oh, it's not a good one. Now he's just like, yeah, it's just a handheld. It's just a soldier game handheld, but it's an MP5. You know, you can put pictures, images on it. Like, this is terrible. This is really bad. Like, I'd only just about pay like 15 bucks for this. And it's definitely taken, like, it might have dodged a few patents from Sony. I, I doubt it even has. And the fact that it has a TF card slot means it's kind of promoting that you can download ROMs onto this thing. And if you're starting to promote that, I know Nintendo do not like that. So if you are going to buy the Soldier Game handheld for 100 bucks, this is what you're going to get. It's a cheap plastic handheld console that can play ROMs. The screen isn't even HD, it's just 480p, which looks absolutely disgusting. The viewing angles are bad. The buttons are like super clicky, like bad clicky. And it's just, I don't know. You'd almost buy this as a gift, like as one of those shit gifts for your friends. Say he's into Sony or he's into PlayStation, he's had a PS Vita. You'd buy him that as a joke, he'd laugh, chuck it in the bin. That's what these are for. Now the fact that Soldier Boy is like, oh, we can't make the Game Boy, so let's try and make something similar like the PS Vita, but we'll call it something different, even though it's got PlayStation button symbols on the back. Shh, it's okay. But it does have a camera, a Super HD camera, which isn't Super HD, it's super crap. That's what it is. So if this actually goes out and people buy this, I'm they're going to be disappointed because this is it. I've had this for months, probably six months. I've had a lot of playtime on this and it hurts. It gives me a headache. It, it amazes me. I, he's persistent, I'll give him that. Fair play to him. He's business minded, he's persistent. He's like, I don't care. I wanna, I wanna sell a load of these. But the fact that he like boasts on Twitter and then he gets shut down and he's moaning at us YouTubers for making videos on it. I'm making a video on it because I don't want you lot to buy this shit. This is bad. Don't spend $100 on it. If you want to buy it, go to AliExpress. Use my affiliate code on eBay. No, don't. That's a joke. Just don't buy it. Please don't buy it. It's not, it's not the greatest retro handle console in the world. Go through my channel. There's tons on there. Pick one of them. So much better than this. And probably just as, as expensive or even less. I don't, I don't know. Just don't buy it. Please. Because this is, this is what you're going to get. This. This is the soldier. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna cut the video. If you wanna hear more from me, hit me up on Twitter. I'll be happy to discuss, but that, I'm just showing you a quick look at what you're gonna get. It's bad, but hilarious. Good try, soldier boy. You're funny, man. Good try. Oh, oh man. I hope people don't buy this.